Hey guys, it's been a while. Uh, as some of you may know, I've been in the market for a new video card for a while now. Uh, been trying to decide between a GTX 275 and a GTX 285. And I've waited so long, still undecided. It's been so long, in fact, that ATI has come out with a new card called the uh, HD 5870. It's uh, 379.99. It's got 850 megahertz core clock. It's got 1600 stream processors. Its memory is clocked in at 1200 megahertz. It's got one gig of RAM, which is GDDR5. It's going to support DirectX 11 when it comes out. Uh, it's got one HDMI port, one Display port, and one and two DVIs. Um, so just for shits and giggles, let's compare that to a GTX 275. Uh, obviously this is a little older so it's cheaper. Um, I already explained all this stuff. You guys can check it out real quick. Um, then we move on to the 285 which is almost the same price. Well not after the rebate it seems. I didn't even see that. But uh, yeah, you guys can look at all this. Um, and then we go to uh, this, which is, let's see how much it is in the cart. $479. And uh, uh, Hardware Canucks, I already reviewed this card. Uh, and it seems to be almost as good as a GTX 295 somehow. For a lot less money. Uh, that's a cruise down here real quick. It's always in second place so far. Not too far behind, only a few frames a second. Still just a few frames a second. Difference. The minimum is a lot better on it. And this is just Crisis, uh, but it's pretty, I've checked this whole thing out and it's pretty much always in second place to the GTX 295. So I was just wondering if anybody actually had this card yet. I don't even know if it's out yet. So if, some, if you guys can give me some feedback, that'd be nice. I don't want to start a whole ATI versus NVIDIA war because I like both. They both have really, really good cards. Uh, so yeah, just let me know what you guys think. And uh, peace out.